everybody, I'm Natalia Bonner. It's day 62 and today I'll be stitching with my inside out machine quilting ruler. Let's get stitching. To stitch out this fun design, I'll use my inside out machine quilting ruler. Starting on the left side of the block, I'm going to line up my machine quilting ruler so that my first line is one inch away from the side of the block. I'll travel up the ruler until I reach the top of the block. From there, I'll adjust my ruler moving over across the ditch one inch. You'll notice I've not done any markings here. I'm just using the markings on my machine quilting ruler. After I've stitched those diagonal lines or those straight lines all the way across the block, then I'm going to go through and add in some fun diagonal lines. I'll travel down to the bottom of the block, that bottom starting starting point. When I get to that bottom starting point, I'm going to be at the point where my machine quilting ruler is a quarter of an inch away from that first stitched line. My needle's going to be right on that first stitch line. You'll notice that I'm using the markings on the inside out ruler, the angular lines, those are a 45 degree angle. I'm lining that up with the side of the block so I know that I've got a nice 45 degree angle stitched line. I'll stitch the first angle from the marked point to the opposite side of the block. From there, I'll travel up the ditch. I'm going to move up about three quarters of an inch, but I do want to kind of adjust my ruler as I'm going so that I can see that I will intersect that bottom diag that bottom straight line with this diagonal line. I'll repeat that process all the way across the block, across the bottom side of the block. After I've stitched all the angular lines, then I will continue stitching angular lines just three quarters of an inch apart across the top portion of the block. Hey friends, I hope you enjoyed today's block and found a little bit of inspiration with my machine quilting. Now just remember, you can pick up the panel, the rulers, the thread, all of the notions that I'm using in this video today over on my website, peaceandquilt.com. And don't forget to share your progress pictures over on Instagram using the hashtag Let's Stitch with Natalia. That's where we will be selecting winners for weekly prizes. See you all tomorrow. Thank you.